A Northwest Las Vegas man says it was a $25 AirTag hidden inside of his car that helped him find it after it was stolen. Once he located it, he followed it in a Tesla that happened to be recording what was going on. I'm Joe Moeller in the Lone Mountain area. That man says he's a little frustrated. Nothing else is being done. I, I, originally, I thought that the car had just been towed. Blake Herman lives in the Lone Mountain area. He woke up one morning and his car was gone. Once I saw it was at somebody else's address, I got up and I, I was going to drive over there and get it back. His black Camry had a tiny Apple AirTag inside. It pinged at a home near Nellis Air Force Base across town. Herman called police, but before they arrived, he went there. I was on the phone and I let them know that I was behind it and that we were moving and they said, well, we don't pursue. We won't pursue a stolen vehicle. Herman jumped in his other car, a Tesla, which has cameras and records video outside of the car. This is video of him following his own car. We got into a little pursuit. He realized maybe a minute, uh, two minutes into me being behind him that I was following him. We started doing laps. He cut through a, a community park. I, I was right behind him the whole way. He was Ultimately, I cornered him and he got out, ran through a storm drain and walked back home. Herman tells me he doesn't know how the suspect broke into his car because it didn't appear to be too damaged aside from the driver's side door. The whole panel was taken off? Yeah, the whole panel, it was not popped off, it was like popped out. He found knives in the back seat and a portable air conditioner in his trunk. So someone's missing a portable air conditioner? Yeah, this is probably theirs. Probably theirs. <laughs> he snapped this photo of the man walking away and says he told police which house the suspect was in. I think I got a response from them three hours later. I asked Metro about it. They tell me it's still an open investigation weeks after it all happened. Herman hopes police can do something. I haven't heard anything. Herman says this $25 air tag turned out to be a good investment. The former Marine says his safety did cross yeah, his mind, but he took the situation into his own hands. I mean, the license plate says veteran. Maybe he stole from the wrong person. Yeah, right. I, yeah, he definitely definitely picked the wrong house. Uh, Herman says the $25 air tag was definitely worth it. He even recommends other folks do the same thing. Reporting in the Northwest Valley, I'm Joe Moore.